I want to look at the RAS map pathway and all the different constituents that are involved in turning on a transcription factor that is usually involved in cell proliferation. So as you know, cell proliferation is just cell division and, and this can be, if mutated, contribute to a lot of different types of cancers. So I'm just going to briefly go through kind of a, a simplified version of this pathway and try and, and explain each molecule as I go. So the first thing that happens is this receptor tyrosine kinase, a growth factor will come in and turn it on. The GRAB2 will come in, as I talked about in the last video, with this SH2 domain, stick to the receptor tyrosine kinase and to this protein called SOS. The SOS will exchange a GDP on RAS for a GTP. And the S, to the, so the SOS is the uh, guanine exchange factor for this protein. Um, once RAS is activated, it will bring in a protein that is called RAF. So this RAS GTP right here, I'm going to put it as the right here. So let's pretend that this is RAS GTP now. So let's pretend this SOS activated this protein just for simplicity's sake. So this is the RAS GTP now. The RAS GTP will then phosphorylate this. So this is the, the inactive version of each one of these kinases. So it will phosphorylate this, this membrane bound, membrane bound RAF, which then will phosphorylate a protein that is called MEC. And MEC will phosphorylate a protein that is called ERK which will then turn on transcription factors. So right here, this is a transcription factor, which will go into the nucle nucleus and turn on genes that are involved in cell proliferation. So once one of the genes that they can activate is called this MK, uh, MPK1, which is a phosphatase, and a, a MAP protein, I just want to discuss really quickly, is, is something that can trigger mitosis. So this is... Uh, this is activated during cell division. And I also wanted to discuss really quickly these right here, this starting from the membrane bound RAF. So I'm just gonna put a circle in a different color around these, these three here from this down to the ERK. So the, the MEC, the membrane bound RAF and the ERK, they are all MAP, so mitogen activated pathways. So we refer to these ones, if there's multiple ones in that cell, we're gonna to refer to uh, the memory man RAF as MAP, K, 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 and then the MEC is MAP, K, K, and then the ERK is MAP, K. Um, so all of these members that are in this pathway can cause cancer if they're mutated. So if the mutation in the gene results in it being sensitive to an on or off signal, so there's there's three different types of, of oncogenes that, that can occur here, or two different types, but proto-oncogenes are genes that have the potential to push a cell towards a malignant state. So that's obviously not a good thing. And then an oncogene is some sort of gene that encodes for a protein here that will promote loss of gross control. And proto-oncogenes can be uh, converted to oncogenes. So you can see that this pathway has been studied multiple times by different researchers and it's currently a focus of a lot of different studies. And when it is mutated, it can lead to detrimental effects and it's actually mutated in a lot of different types of cancers.